What's up, card family? Jetman80 back here with another video. Oh, wow. This is the week 17 re recrap. It's the last one of the year. Wow. Jets won. Beat the Bills. What was it? 13 to 6. Sloppy game. Bills really didn't have any of their starters playing. But the Jets did finish the season. The last eight games, they went 6 and 2. Uh, I mean, if they won, these are just ifs. I mean, if they beat the Bengals, like they should have, that first Miami game, and the first Buffalo game. I can even take that first Buffalo game out. I mean, if they beat Miami and they beat Cincinnati, they'd be 9-7, nine, nine and seven, and maybe have a shot at a wild card. But if you put that Bills game in, where they had it all game and they blew it in the fourth. Because that field goal kicker they had the first week was freaking shit. Speaking of field goal kickers, today that Sam Thicken, he missed a 35-yarder. Yes, it was raining, but you're not kicking into any wind or anything. And he didn't just miss it, he shanked it. It's like horrible. The offseason just need to find themselves a decent kicker. And, you know, with the amount of injuries, the Jets today had like 20 guys on the IR. Jets were the, one of the most injury plagued teams in the NFL. They finished the year 7 and 9. After that start, with Sam being out with Mono. And to still come back and, you know, be kind of respectable, almost get to 800, 800, almost get to 500. I I have hope it's leading into next season. Hopefully Joe Douglas, our GM, does the right moves. And I'm going to say this again. O-line, O-line, O-line. They just need O-line. They need a kicker. And they need a true number one receiver. I love Robbie Anderson, but the guy is a uh, number two at best. He th he thinks he's a number one, but uh, I I don't I don't see it. Uh, Sam grew a lot this year as a quarterback. I think next year will be a true breakout year for him. Especially you know he has one year under Gase. Gase's offensive system under his belt. And we'll see what happens. Gase does know quarterbacks. And how to work with them. Um, I know Madden Crazy Titans fans are going to hate me for saying this. But look at Tannehill. I, I, Tannehill was always seen to be hurt with Gase. But under Gase, Tannehill became a better quarterback. You could, you could see his improvement. And I think Tannehill took some of that that Gaze taught him with him to the Titans. All right, everyone, I'm going to wrap it up. It was an up and down emotional season of Jets football. Like it always is, but they are my team. They are my cross to bear, my burden to bear. I'll never stop rooting for him. I'll never stop being a fan through good times and bad. Oh, speaking of bad, Pat, come on. The Browns are getting destroyed by the Bengals. <laughs> All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy your football Sunday. And if your teams are going to the playoffs, good luck. Except for you Patriots fans. Because, you know, there you go. <laughs> All right, all. J-E-T-S, Jets, Jets, Jets. Peace.